Welcome to English Tea Time. Hey guys, this is Robert from the Derneck. How are you doing? We are really missing everybody. And so we had an idea that we would make these little video clips. And once a week, we'll put out a little quick clip. And since you're not able to come to the Derneck, where we can have, you know, English lessons or conversation time. We thought we'd make a little clip once a week and we can talk about a certain topic and just put it out there and you can watch us, follow us and comment and reply to us, ask us questions or whatever you want to do. So this week we're going to talk about how to introduce someone to someone else. Okay. The first thing you need to think about when you're going to introduce one person to another person is to which one do I introduce first, okay? And there are four things to help you determine this, okay? They are age, gender, longevity, and relationship, okay? And I'll talk about each of those. The first is age. So, the person who is older, significantly older, has a higher rank, okay? So, the person who is 70 years old has a higher rank than the person who is 20 years old, okay? The person with gender, so a female has a higher rank than a male for introduction purposes, and we'll talk about this more. The one I've known longest has a higher rank than someone who I've known for a lesser amount of time. So my friend that I've known all my life has a higher rank than someone I have just known for one year. Okay? And then relatives have a higher rank in the introduction process. So my cousin has a higher rank than my friend from school. Okay? Okay? Thirdly, now that you've determined that, and it's time to make the introduction, what you want to do is say the name of the person with the higher rank. Say their name first, but introduce the person of lower rank to the higher person. For example, Let's say I have two friends. This is Hector. He's a king. This is Achilles. He's just a foot soldier. Okay? So Hector has a higher rank. And Achilles has a lower rank. So at our party, I would say, Hector, I would like to introduce my friend Achilles to you. Okay? So by doing that, I said Hector's name first, but I introduced the lower rank to the higher rank. Okay, now it's time to put into practice what we've learned. Okay, we're going to do a scenario. I'm going to make an introduction. Watch closely and see if I do it right. Okay, remember the things... That we talked about what makes a person of a higher rank, okay, and the process to do that. So, for this scenario, I'm Robert from the Derneck. This is my cousin, Aisha from Trabzone. This is a student of mine from school, from a school that I teach in. Okay, so we're in a social situation, informal, and I'm going to make the introduction. So... How's it going? How are you doing? Oh, Elijah. Aisha, I'd like you to meet my student, Elijah. He's also from Trob Zone. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, did we do it right? Okay, did you notice? Aisha is a higher rank. Why? Number one, female. Number two, older. Number three, She's a cousin, relative, so she's higher. I said her name first and introduced the younger to the higher. 
All right, good job.